What Makes the Seasons? By Megan Montague Cash. The day began with sprinkling rain, tapping at the window pane. Rain has turned the sky to gray. Our snowman friend has gone away. Fresh green leaves are peeking out. What makes this their time to sprout? Spring's mild weather wakes the seeds, bringing showers each seed needs. Spring was here, but couldn't stay. Spring left on a summer day. Plants that once were hardly there now have flowers everywhere. Each tree and weed and lima bean shows its favorite shade of green. Why is this a growing season? Plants grow tall, but what's the reason? Plants grow best in summer light, when days are long and warm and bright. But when the summer days are done, the autumn days have just begun. The sun grows dim, the wind blows cold. Green leaves turn to red and gold. The colored leaves dance all around, but why do leaves fall to the ground? In all the leaves on all the trees are teeny tree food factories. Leaves use sun to make the food. When there's less sun, leaves come unglued. The weather brought a change last night. Winter turned the world to white. Puffy flakes swirled high and low. Snow makes flurries. What makes snow? In chilly clouds, the raindrops freeze. It's one of winter's recipes. Winter is a time for sleep. Trees are resting. Seeds will keep. Many creatures sleep and wait. Winter's time to hibernate. But what controls the seasons change, and what makes weather rearrange? Earth's yearly trip around the sun affects the seasons one by one. In summer, when the days are long, the sun shines down both hot and strong. While winter has the shortest days, less time for Earth to get warm rays. But when you have a winter day, it's summer half the world away. If summer blossoms open wide, it's winter on Earth's other side. Seasons change four times a year. When each one ends, the next one's here. Enjoying changes one by one makes the seasons so much fun.